Hello there, welcome to Beto James' review of SmackDown and a little bit of wrestling discussion for the 7th of September 2012. Today is the 8th of September. Let's have a quick review of what happened on SmackDown then. Let's have a look here. Ah, oh, Bob Del Rio, Ricardo Rodriguez, and David Otongo were shown inside the general manager's office. They came straight to the ring. Ricardo was wearing a neck brace. Del Rio spoke and received the watch treatment. The air demand is a bro kicks with a goal of having a band. Booker T came out and asked the fans whether they should ban the kick. The fans were against it, so the kick was still legal. So they are trying to sell Del Rio as the main event character. Yeah, he has to go on the mic. First match of the night, we'll come back to that later. First match of the night, Rey Mysterio and Sin Cara defeated the Miz and Cody Rhodes. Cody accidentally kicked the Miz, Rey followed up with a 6 1 9 for the win. Let's go back for a match, and Jared and uh, Sin Cara is amazing. Live, I'm sure. Horse Hogan stunt on Daniel Bryan's show, throw in as a recap of the Hug It Out segment from Raw. We should all hug it out. Let's all hug it out. And we've been back to David Otonga. Backstage, Booker T backstage threatening to press legal action. Oh God. Zack Ryder defeated Daniel Bryan by reverse decision. Bryan came out, tried to remain calm. He got upset and a yes chance through the match. Begged off Ryder's attack and they hugged. Why? This led to Brian applying the no lock. <laughs> Brian won by submission, but he refused to reach the hole, so the referee released the decision, reversed the decision. Brian essentially lost to the yes chant. We are backstage with Randy Orton. I have voices in my head. But the great Damien Sander, who I love, came out and cut a promo to discuss his actions in the match. Ripping on social media. Ah! I too good to do this review for you. <laughs> and he's interrupted by Orton who went to the huge pop. Or on the forum Booker T switches the original report with Sandow. Sandow. The Randy Orton defeated Sandow by Canada. Oh yeah, Dolph Ziggler, who's really becoming a great part of the SmackDown show. Join the commentary team. Sandow ran to the back at the middle rope DDT where Orton was called for for the RKO, leading to a counter finish. Orton and Ziegler, Ziegler first, Sander came back to save Ziegler from the RKO and took one himself, allowing Dolph to escape. Otongo back to David Otonga. Matthias argued that the bro kick should be banned. He brought X rays, Booker T, booked the match between Otonga and Sheamus. And then we went to the tag team, we got the prime time players, the Vita Prima and Epico with Rosa, to become the number one contenders. Kobe Kingston and R-True were on commentary. Yes, the number one players are number one contenders for the one million time. But they need a manager. They need a manager. What's to do? Why not over here going to see the light? Oh, look. That's all right. <laughs> anyway. Next. Wade Barrett. Long way to return. Very low key. He just bought the great Yoshi Tosu. Who I like. And he cut another pre pre promo saying he does not want to fight these guys. No. He wants real competition. And we have a video of Bret Hart appearing on Raw next week from Montreal. Hmm. And I come to the main event of the night. Sheamus defeated David Otonga. Alberto came out to watch the match. Sheamus hit the white noise and set up the broke kick. Booker T came out and interrupted the match. Eventually banned the broke kick. Sheamus won with the Cloverleaf, not the Texas Cloverleaf, the Irish Cloverleaf, after the Irish Cross. So there you have it. It was a good show, it was a great, great show. I enjoy SmackDown very much. Uh, I never watch it on a Friday night, I always watch it on Friday afternoon. Oh, it still becomes available online. Check out TerryTV.com. Anyway, this is a response to my little review of SmackDown. Short review of SmackDown. But that's the way I like it, nice and short. 
You want a long review? Well, then go to the British Fist. I was asking. Yeah. And I'm looking forward to Raw on Monday. Morning. <laughs> and catch up and watch NXT and yeah, NXT this week. Hmm. I haven't seen it yet. It's a great show. Now watch out for more reviews and more wrestling videos from Beto James on the Beto James channel. And don't forget, watch out for Evil James on the Beto Boy channel. I will smack down a bee. Uh, great show, not much better this week. It was good. And Sayonara. Au revoir. In French. Oh! For gold, I'm going to show you this thing. This is my championship belt. No, it's not. It's my little tag from Epilepsy. It's a new thing. I can't see it on the camera there. Well, whatever. My phone was on that. Okay, then you have it outside. Now, what the hell? I drunk my teeth. Hello? I thank all six viewers for watching this and. Uh, Please your comments in the uh, your comments below. I won't ask me any questions. Please do, because I'll do a Q and A too. Bye now. Subscribe to the following people below. Who laughed to full of joy at this better boy?